What is up guys? This footage might look a little bit different. Uh, it's because I'm shooting on my GoPro Hero 5. I just bought it. Uh, main reasons why is because it has different um, looks to it. You can actually change it from a fisheye view to a linear mode, which basically makes it so my face doesn't like blow up when I bring the camera closer to me. And also it has video stabilization, which is a absolute plus, and it has voice commands, which is really nice too, so I can just tell it to stop recording. I thought it wasn't gonna work if I just said that, but apparently it did. <laughs> so I am on my way to Seattle right now to do another day of filming. Um, I can't promise you this is gonna be a good vlog because I can't show a lot of it, so maybe afterwards once the video is completely released and everything, I can, but for now I cannot show a lot. So. I'm actually just driving up there right now. It's going to be about an hour, hour to an hour and a half of a drive, depending on traffic. And we're going to, I'm, big, I'm going to be, I'm pretty much going to be doing uh, behind the scenes and I think a little bit of acting like I did the other day. And I don't know how long it's going to go for, who knows, but I don't have anything going on tomorrow, so I can stay as long as I can. Um, then we got the Seahawks game tonight, which I might miss. Maybe I might see part of it or the end of it, who knows. with this because it might inspire others to try vlogging with a GoPro because I heard it's good audio and plus it's waterproof you won't damage your camera it has video stabilization you can shoot up to 4k but that uh, limits things so if you shoot up to 4k you can't have video stabilization is what I see um, then you have video commands um, GoPro commands that's what I meant to say uh, and it's so, it's somewhat a good, decent price. Four hundred dollars, I believe, is what it was. Um, or four hundred dollars is what it is, I believe. And that's not too bad for a camera that can shoot up to 4K and it's waterproof and everything. Um, I would give this a try if you guys want to try vlogging or anything. I would give this a try. I like it so far. It's nice and small. You can stick it in your pocket. Everything. It's such a nice camera to have. I mainly want it so if I'm going underwater or hiking or anything like that, I like to have like a selfie stick on me and just kind of get the, the surroundings of where I'm at. Alright, just arrived at location in this big apartment building complex. Let's do this. What up guys? It has been a long day. It is now 7.30. I am going home. Well, I gotta stop by a friend's house first to pick up something. This is the GoPro's low light. I don't know exactly how well it's gonna turn out. I don't even know if you're supposed to have a setting turned on to do well at low light. I don't know. But uh, this is what it looks like. It's at actually, let's see, 3200 for ISO. Um, I might be too high, it might make it too noisy, who knows, but it was a good day. Did a lot of behind the scenes and I had a lot of fun watching people act. And uh, yeah, it was a good day. Now since I got nothing going on tomorrow, my goal is to get everything organized and put away into organized files and everything like that. I really need it. I haven't had any time to do it and I need to do it. What is up? I just got home. I just finished watching the Seahawks game and I wanted to wait till after that till I started editing this footage that I shot today. So when you see this, I actually this is actually from this day, and I'm gonna try and upload two videos tomorrow if I can, if I'm feeling in the in the mood and everything. But uh, for now, I'm I really want to get this video edited and then head to bed. I'm just starting a fresh day tomorrow and trying to get all my files and videos and everything I shot over the weekend organized, so I'm not out of hand and get cleaned up a little bit. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to stay strong, dance, and live life.